Arcana. <laughs> what is with this music? I don't I don't remember this music. Kano v Kano. Kano Mano. Yeah, we're going back to Mortal Kombat 10. Believe it, mate. Jang Sun did this. He made plenty of us. Round one. Fight. Mm. So I tend to play commando style Kano in uh NKX. Because then I get to do all the throw shit. But then I fail to do the throw shit properly, so. First round is me getting used to this shit again. It has been fucking years. <laughs> but you know. Oh, that's up ball. That's forward ball. Round two, fight! I remember really liking this Kano design. And now I'm looking at it and I'm like... Mm, I mean, it's alright. But I remember really thinking it was really cool. Mm. Just gotta punch, punch it, punch it. Ah. There, take that. Oh shit. Oh shit. No. There, I will. That uppercut damage, holy shit. Nothing personal, mate. Kano wins. I forgot that on this save, I do not have his second fatality or his brutalities unlocked, because. I forgot, like, it's been at least five years I was playing this on my friend's gaming PC. So, yeah. Big boss want talk. Well, I don't want talk. Can we stop? Round one. Yeah, I'm just gonna check some shit. Hey guys, remember Ferrator? Hey, look, there's there's the one fatality I have. Like, honestly, I like this like, layout, you know. Okay. Like, his threats come through during his throws really loudly in the mix. I don't know what it is, but they really boosted it. Look, it's meat. Round two, fight. I used to know someone who used to main Ferrator, but they weren't very good. They were like a really casual gamer of this, so... You can kind of forgive that, where they're just like, I'm just gonna play the fighting game. And, oh look, this character looks fun, and then they just play a character based off of random design. Although I don't know how you could look at Ferrator and go, wow, what an interesting design. Brown. <laughs> but, you know, what's the style at the time? Excuse me while I immediately forget. So this, this fatality is not... Wait, wait, wait. There we go. First ever fatality on this save. No child violence. Yeah, like, I'd always say, like, definitely just pick random character or, like, a character you like the look of when you're starting off playing a fighting game. Don't get too, like, 
Oh, but that's not Ryu. Like, just pick whoever you like. Like, I'm playing Kano here. Like, you know what I mean? Like, just pick who you think looks cool. What your interests are. Like, you know. You make me sick. <laughs> Kunji. Watch your tongue, or I'll have it. Thanks for the bright red target. Round one. Fight. None of that made sense. <laughs> hey guys, remember Kung Jin? He was the gay character. <laughs> it got rid of, holy shit. <laughs> it's subtly hinted in some of his like back and forth with Ra uh, Raiden that he's uh, gay. But it's really subtle. And then the fact that him and. Is it Takeshi or Takeshi? Oh god, I'm saying his name wrong. Just don't show up in the next game. Which is really weird because I like the other guy. The other new male character they introduced. That was a good guy. Whose brain. My brain is broken. So like, yeah, I like the speed at which throws come out in this game. And how you can just do shit like that where they're still recovering and just be like, yeah, I grab you. Wish. I win. I did it wrong again. <laughs> It's like every time. Yeah, Kung Jin was an interesting character if you ignore the fact that he's just like, he reminded me way too much of like the Green Arrow in all of the Injustice games, so I was just like, because he's Bowman. Dead. Kano wins. Fatality. It's kind of a lame fatal. I mean, it uses something on Kano's character, so it's better than, like, you know, just a generic kill, which the second fatality is just he stabs you. Like, he throws a knife at you, and this time he kills you, rather than all the other times he throws knives at you and it doesn't kill you. You betray the Emperor. Perhaps a bit. Now, this is justice. <laughs> Man, Ermac's cool. Not this outfit for Ermac, but yeah, Ermac was cool. Sad he's gone. But eleven. I'm not sure if I. I'm not sure which move set I like for Kano the most, like MKX or MK11. I think I like MK11s a little more because it's more tightened up. But like, he's got more stuff in X, like he, he can do more stuff, like with each variation. He's got a high and a low parry here. And he's got an up ball and like three different move, throw moves that aren't combo into. I love also how the great thing about Kano is no matter who you face off with, uh, normally their opening thing is, you're an asshole, you betrayed us. <laughs> like, because he's just a scumbag <laughs> who betrays everyone if you give him a chance. You'll notice I go for the choke throw much more often than the other, and that's because it's faster inputs. I need you. Nothing I need KMD. I I will shave with this blunt knife. Yeah. Well, I have to think about which Kano I like the most. Like move sets and design. Time for sub. Wow, this this looks like a weirdly dated costume now. 
Obviously, this is the classic, but. Pity you chose to thaw out. Round one. Fight. <laughs> He's just sliding everywhere. I don't remember this. It's top with the ice clones, you Mr. Ice. Mr. Cool Ice. Vanilla Ice. Wow. Oh, shit. I hate it when the AI sub freezes you and just watches you like a dumbass for a full second and you're like. <laughs> ice clones, man. Oh, pfft. Ow. Round two. Fight. It's not fair, it's raining. He has an advantage. <laughs> With the ice pallets. Shit. He's just comboing me into statues. To be fair, I'm just a dude. <laughs> He's had some parts replaced because he keeps getting like a, like mortally injured. Gotta stay sharp. And he's an ice ninja. <laughs> I'm just I'm just an angry cyborg Australian. Yeah, I really like the air version of the the Kano ball. Because he then goes for a low, it's pretty cool. And then the enhanced version is pretty cool. I like them in both games. I'm sure they're busted as all fuck. That's why I like them. I will throw a knife. I have to admit, the knife throwing animation in 11 is much nicer. This x ray is pretty good though, but then the x ray in 11 is pretty fucking good for Kano. I forgot again, I'm sorry. Because <laughs> I keep facing a different way each time, I swear. Sub zero. More like just plain zero. Kano wins. Fatality. Dead. Who else did I play in X? So this is the first time I played MKX where I could actually play as Triborg and I played him like once when I first got this game because I got it in a bundle with Injustice 2 on PS4, they had it on sale. And I was like, ooh, Triborg. But aside from that, I think I played Kano, uh, a little bit Reptile, a little bit Ermac. Hello. You repulse us, hideous one. Rude. Fight. You're a bug lady, and I'm an Australian. We are, like, obviously the ultimate. I really don't like his combo into throw there, He's, where he just kind of flops on you. It just feels a bit, like, flaccid, like it's not... It needs more impact in the animation. Like, the punches are thumpy. But when he does that throw, he's like, Nyeh. he just puts you on the floor and lies on you. It's just a bit like, what are you doing? <laughs> she, she loves to do that jab. I still don't like Devora. Fight me. Round two. Fight. She's designed for people who like the Antwoord. <laughs> I feel like that's a thing. She reminds me of Deantford. Stop with your little super soaker insect. Fine, barrel. Man, who else did I play in this game? Jeez. I have a think. Yeah, it's nice to go back to something older. Fresh her. I will try. <laughs> I fucking forgot the like every time it just falls out my brain because it's like slightly odd 
directional inputs. Don't worry, guys. I, I killed Devore, you don't have to look at her anymore. All those bug creeps who wanted to sleep with her, that's just weird, man. I got coins. I got paid. Oh, it's Jackie. Man, Jackie Briggs, between the two games, Cassie Cage looks relatively similar. You can kind of see it, her hair's grown a little longer. Jackie Briggs looks like a different fucking person. Gonna give you to General Blade. It's fine with me. Not in one piece, of course. Round one. Oh, I get it, sassy. Yeah, no, like, literally, like, Jackie looks thinner, paler, a different face. Yeah, she's a different character in this game to what she later turned into in 11 and like 11 she does more cool kickboxing shit but I still don't care enough about her because no offense to her like it's just every human character who isn't Kano basically I'm just like ah, I don't really give a shit I love how when MKX came out, I was like, I'm sad that there's no playable smoke. <laughs> then they kind of released Triborg, and there's like a smoke, cyber smoke in there somewhere. And it's okay. But then it's like, oh, maybe MK11, there'll be, there'll be smoke. There wasn't smoke. <laughs> there was a noob, though. How is it that rain was in 9 and 11, but smoke was only in 9? Why is everyone hating on smoke? Again. Because it's the other way around now. Da 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 da. I'm glad she lifted her visor so I could see the horrendous gore. Fatality. I remember when I looked at MKX, I was like, wow, that looks so realistic. When it was shown first at E3, without all the health bars or anything, it was just like sub versus scorp, and it looked, and they were interacting with like the environment and stuff. I was like, wow, that's so good. And now you look at it now, after 11, and you're like, oh, it's, it, it's aged. It's aged. Scumbag. Tulsa. <laughs> You're getting a punch down under. Round one. Fight. Kind of lame one liners as well. breakers in this. Didn't help. Mr. King. Fight. Oh, he punched me in the balls. What if Kano's got cyborg balls? Asking the real questions here. Now. That curved up. Okay, just hitting a button every time I hit a button that's faster. I'm just gonna stamp on your feet then. I'm just gonna sit here trading normals like weirdos. Oh god, I fucking forgot it again. Uh, I'm sure Johnny will, won't mind. I really like Kano's tattoos in this game. I always thought, oh, that's cool, he's got like the black dragons going all over his shoulders. But when you look up close to them, they're kind of like low detail. And then they're kind of 
not there, I don't think. I'm going to have to remind myself when I next play 11. I don't know if that version of Kano has them. What's well, Goro? Yeah, it plays Goro. Kano. Your Highness, I will not abide your mockery. <laughs> How did you know I was mocking you? Whatever, any excuse to fight. Oh, he's doing the stampo. I'll slit your throat. That'll do you. I'll choke out Goro. <laughs> Starting to use the up ball like it's just a sure you can on wake up, just like. Waha! <laughs> and like it doesn't work like that. I'm pretty sure it has too much startup. Ain't worth spitting on. But that is surprisingly fast coming out with choke, so. Round two, fight. Really shut them down with some of these throws. Ah, fuck. Why? Haha. Haha. Kind of similar to the 11 one, where he kind of takes you down on that enhanced version of the Kano Ball. The Air Kano Ball. Yeah. I need to, I need to relearn the combo. Always different combo. Ah, fuck. I don't wanna. When it's uncertain, spam the X-ray. <laughs> The AI is like what? Further shroom. I can't. God damn it! <laughs> oh, every time. Something, something. I just can't make it a pattern that I remember in my head. I'm so much shorter than you. This makes no sense. Fatality. Like, he's straight up a head taller than me. How am I hitting him with my eye laser? Baba. Final opponent. Shinnok. I actually forgot until I was playing this. Holy shit, yeah, Shinnok is the final boss in this. I forgot how. I what is your purpose here? His tiny little bone hands. <laughs> Look at his fucking little chicken hands. You've nothing to offer. Round one. <laughs> I put my hands in a pot of boiling oil by accident and now I have bony bone hands. It's like he had he literally looks like he had a deep fryer incident. <laughs> Literally so unforgettable, so forgettable that I was like, oh shit, yeah, Shinnok's the final boss, isn't he? Not Shao Kahn. Because it's almost always Shao Kahn. But actually, I lie. But then again, it only just occurred to me now holy shit, Quan Chi died in this version, didn't he? And they didn't even bother bringing him back due to time travel shenanigans in like the next game. Like, they brought Shao Kahn and a bunch of other people back through the time shit. And then they were like, what's a Quan Chi? And they just kind of wrote him out. Well, obviously he's mentioned in the background relating to Scorpion, but like, barely. Shang Tsung is mentioned more. So this also threw me for a loop because I was like, wait, what? I thought on round two of him being defeated, he turns into like super powered resurrection Shinnok. But actually you have to fight him twice and then fight him again. Yeah, I'm just letting you power up like it's Dragon Ball Z. Tremble before me as I absorb Earthrealm's power. Good for you, mate. <laughs> now I'm a Diablo. <laughs> Final round, fight. 
apparently higher forms of evolution mean loincloths and only three fingers on each hand, so yeah. Efficiency rather than like dexterity, I guess. Whatever the fuck that is, I mean. <laughs> ah, I see your like empowered up form doesn't make you knife proof, even though you have magma skin. Thanks for the beam. Fuck. Choking out Satan. <laughs> He's like, whoa, whoa, why am I being, being beaten by an Australian? Oh, all the power of Earth around beaten by a random Australian. <laughs> oh, all my cringe. And then everyone forgot Shinnok existed. Kano had always been a survivor, but even he would one day succumb to fate. His ideals of ruthless terror would die with him, unless he could pass on his methods to a new generation. <laughs> Combat, weapons, high-tech sabotage, torture... Glad they gave the trainee his the big curriculum. dumb fucking Australia knife. students could learn his techniques, Kano would beat the weakness out of them. They would understand or die trying. <laughs> Kano's first pupil, his own son. Class was now in session. God, his son looks super generic. I'm glad he didn't become a character because he's just generico. Okay, that's arcade mode for Kano. Fun.